Hi, it's Dolls, Toys, and Games Gal. I'm super excited to show you my newly finished bed for Ever After High's newest character, Jillian Beanstalk. The first thing I always do when I make a bed for a character is I try to find the right fabric for their bedspread. In her case, I settled on this uh, because I really like the curly lines. They remind me of a beanstalk. And I also like these shapes here that remind me of string beans. To make her beanstalk bed posts, I found these extra thick dowel rods. I think they are 7 16 of an inch thick and I painted them green to match her bedspread fabric. Next I found this awesome trim from Hobby Lobby. The reason it's awesome is it looks like leaves climbing up a trellis, perfect for Jillian. And after cutting down the bedspread to the right size, I'm going to hot glue on this piece of trellis trim right up the middle. Then I'm going to use this ribbon called Olive Leaves from Paper Source and I'm going to line the trellis trim with it. And then using these um, Ofre flower um, accessories, I'm going to hot glue them onto each side of the ribbon so that it looks like beanstalk flowers. And that's what I came up with. Then I'm gonna line the edges of the blanket with this Ofre ribbon that happens to match the flowers, like so. Then I'm going to line the top and bottom of the blanket with gold braid. And her blanket is complete. To make her bed itself, I hot glued two smooth foam blocks together. Then I chose this fabric to be her bed sheet. I like it because it's brown and has the suggestion of vines on it. I'm going to hot glue leaves to the side of her bed, but just the part where it would actually show. Then I'm going to hot glue this green and gold ribbon around the entire bed. After I did that, it's time to make the bean stalks. So what I did was grab some artificial greenery and I wound them around the beanstalk poles like so. And now I'm going to be adding leaves to the sections where the vines cross. And this is what one of the finished beanstalk poles looks like. And this is what four of them look like. And this is what it looks like when you hot glue four of them to the finished bed. It does need a little something, so I'm going to make a headboard and a footboard. To make the headboard and the footboard, I'm using these wall decals, uh, leaves that are for wall decals, and I hot glued them to the head of the bed for her headboard. And um, let me give you a look at it from far away. And now, of course, I need to do something for the foot of the bed because that just looks quite plain. So similarly, I took the wall decal leaves and hot glued them to the foot of the bed. Then I decided to make some cute uh, vines using pipe cleaners and um, craft glitter paper. And you can just string the leaves on. This actually came out of a creativity, uh, creatology kit. And then I hot glued that to the foot of the bed. And then I also, around the tops of the poles, wound some across the top, uh, as you can see. And um, finally, to make a pillow, I took two squares of that fabric. I'm going to be hot gluing them together. I've done that and added on the trellis trim and it's time to add cotton balls and hot glue the fourth side. And now that's done and I added one more flower and hot glued on more of the olive leaves ribbon. And then just for fun I took these three green uh, pom-poms, hot glued them together and put a little thing of pipe cleaner around it so it would look like you know peas in a pod or beans. And I'm um, just going to add some more of the flowers to the beanstalk poles. And then the tops of the poles look unfinished, so I'm going to make tops of the pole decorations um, with the leaves and some more lavender colored flowers like this. And now that I've done four of them, I'm going to add them to the tops of the poles. And now we have a, an almost finished Jillian beanstalk bed. It's just missing her pillow blanket and Jillian. So let's put on her pillow. And now let's put on her blanket. And our final touch, our little beans or, or peas. And voila! Here is my finished Jillian beanstalk bed. And that's a look at it from one angle. And here's a look at it from the other angle. Oh, yeah, let's see how Jillian looks with it. Here she comes. Hi, Jillian. I hope you like your new bed. I love it personally. 
Next step is to make a dorm room for Jillian and Nina. And now let's do a shout out. Here's a shout out to Violet Fan Ever After High Lover. Thank you guys so much for watching my videos. And I hope you enjoyed this one as much as I enjoyed making it for you. See you soon.